President Trump said good morning today, a remark that sent shockwaves through the political establishment. The New York Times, a former newspaper, issued an editorial demanding the president retract the insensitive remark, which the Times said did not take into account the plight of American blacks and women whose mornings have been permanently marred by slavery and sexual harassment. Afterward, the president walked outside the White House, where he healed the sick and restored sight to the blind, an action to which CNN's Don Lemon immediately objected, saying it violated the separation of church and state. Lemon then attempted to storm out of the studio, but walked into a corner of the room and couldn't find his way out. Lemon had to be removed by an emergency medical team. Later, President Trump plans to walk atop the water in the Washington Mall reflecting pool, which NBC's Chuck Todd said will be an act of war against the environment and will lower the Capitol's clean water standards. When accused of biased reporting, Todd said the charge was absurd and pointed out that he would soon be hosting a hard-hitting 60-minute special on how Barack and Michelle Obama continue their courageous fight for women's reproductive rights by slaughtering and devouring unborn children. So that's all right then. Trigger warning, I'm Andrew Clavin, and this is The Andrew Clavin Show. I feel hunky-dunky, life is tickety-boo. Birds are winging, also singing, hunky-dunky-dee. Ship-shaped, ipsy-topsy, the world is a bitty zing. It's a wonderful day, hooray, hooray, it makes me want to sing. Oh, hurrah, hurrah.